Hi everyone, I'm Joanne. Welcome to my craft room. I'm on Junk Journal January, day eight, which is neutrals. Um, I didn't show you day seven, which is stitched. Um, that's on this side. So I just kind of collaged and um, stitched around here and then stitched the word stitch <laughs> and then put that on the top. So that was stitched. Um, today is neutrals. I may have mentioned that. And I covered um, the back of this page. So it's a page from a um, garden book. And it's obviously not neutral. So I just kind of collaged on top of it with some neutral colors, which to me, this whole book honestly could be, except this maybe, neutrals. Um, so I'm not sure where I'm going at this point with it, but I did kind of want a focal point. And to me, this is neutral and I thought it was pretty, but I don't want this kind of fake looking lace up top. So I think I'll rip it and see what I'm left with here. I don't even mind that. Uh, maybe not such a straight edge at the bottom. I may bring some music paper in because I like music paper and it's certainly neutral, moderately. I don't know if I want that word there. What's on the back? All right, let me just, I have all kinds of scraps from this um, journal to my right and then another project I'm working on here. So there's a follow my channel. I know that lately I've just been really heavy on the junk journal January and it's mainly because I'm just really trying to keep up. Um, I can get behind with these things and then, you know, before I know it, I'm way behind and I either don't finish it or whatever, but I do like that, but I don't like the straight edge down here. I'm going to cut that off and put that there maybe. And this music paper. Um, I also have these stamps, which I think all of them are neutral, which may look pretty good somewhere on here. Um, what else do I have? Oh, I pulled this. Again, very neutral. Uh, do I need it? It's kind of full of me because this paper back here from this page is showing through, which is nice because it picks up a lot of this. But I keep thinking that's the edge of the page and it's not. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Hmm, let me rip this a little bit and see what I can do here. Be something like that. I don't mind that. Let me try audition this piece here. If that that would go like this. Maybe down like that. And then maybe one of these stamps or something down here. I don't mind this at all. I think I'm going to put that on. What did I do with my gluing page? I had a gluing page right here. Like literally right here. Oh, here it is. <laughs> Forever looking for things on my desk. So let me put this down. So I'm actually working on some, I don't know if you'd call it Valentine's projects, but or love, maybe love. Um, I'll show you that in a second. When I'm done this. So that's kind of pretty. Maybe, well, I had that up against the edge. Maybe up a little further, like that. No, I think that should be there. And this should be in here somewhere. All right, or maybe up a little more, because I do have that little piece of white there, which I don't mind it down here, 
uh, but I don't mind it there really either. But let's glue this. Hope everybody's well. It's a really kind of sunny day here in southern New Jersey. It's in the 40s, which I was out running some errands earlier. Went up to Trader Joe's and I had to pick up tennis balls because I spilled um, some brown Chinese gravy all down the front of my coat yesterday, coming home from a friend's house. And I had to wash it. And they said to put, because it's down filled or fiber filled, I'm not sure if it's down, but they said to put tennis balls in there and I didn't have any. The other thing was they said tin foil balls of tinfoil, but to me that gets hot. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't want to do that. So I stopped and picked up the most inexpensive tennis balls I could find at the sports store, which they weren't bad. They were like three for $3.49, so I didn't mind that so much. Um, I even forget why I was out, oh, because I was running errands and it's beautiful out. And then I took down my outside decorations for Christmas. And I have to get that down in my basement as I go down to the laundry and stuff. Ugh, too old for all this. That I kind of like there. Move it over some. So it's not super even. I do like that. I don't know. This may be pretty much done. When I collage, especially on cat, I just feel like I keep adding things. And, um... I almost want to say that's pretty good there. I don't want to keep putting more of these stickers. Do I have anything else to my right I like? I have some real old music paper. kind of like the way that looks. I don't want to ruin it. Um, let me see. Yeah, I want to put a little more of this. I just wanted to jump on and kind of share today because it was an easy day for me because neutrals are neutrals are easy for me. Don't know if I like that so solid or like that. That or there's a little paw coming up behind my desk. It startled me for a second. That I don't mind, and then I feel like I need to even it or balance it down there. Like I said, I just keep going. I'm, I really just need to stop when it's time to stop. Um, let me put that like that. I think that's a little better. And then just a little piece down here. And we're gonna call it, and this might be the little piece. And then we'll just call it a day. Yeah, I like that. So what's everybody working on? Are you doing Junk Journal January? I've really liked it so far. I've, I think the prompts are very doable. And, um, you know, they're doable and I, I watch some people and, and some days I really don't watch anything or they're not out yet for the day. But I don't know, does it need something through here? See, this is what I start doing. I just feel like I need to break this up a little bit here. Um, I don't want to introduce anything new into the page. I obviously wouldn't do it like that. Well, maybe this. I love working maybe from this side, right through there. Is it too much? I wish we were live and you could give me your opinion. <laughs> um, do you know what I'm saying? I just feel like that's too much in there. What do I like? What do I want? I do have this dictionary. What's this? Oh, it's some of that ledger right there. 
it's the other piece of this fake ledger or print of a ledger. Maybe that. Yeah, I think that's good. I think this is too big. And I think that kind of does the trick a bit. Right in there. Yeah, I think I like that. All right, so that's going to be it. And I'm going to show you what I'm working on quickly. Which has nothing to do with this junk journal January, but... Like I said, I've been so involved with that. Yeah, I like that how it breaks it up. So it's just a little collage for um, for neutral. And I'm not going to write the word. Some days I do. Um, like throwback, quote, intentions. I've stitched over there. But this one I don't think I'm going to. Maybe I'll put the date down there. I don't know. But I like it. So anyhow, what I'm working on, I'll show you, is this... Um, journal which it's gonna have this this it's gonna open like this but here's the journal papers pocket here pocket here and then that so I'll work on all this you know lace and putting a topper and everything on but yeah these are Amity Bloom's papers and I made the base with cardstock what I started and kind of gave up a little bit on it but I'm going to go back to it because, you know, when you walk away from things uh, for a while and then you're like, oh, it's not that bad, actually. So as I didn't cover everything. It's kind of the same. So it has this and this. It, this isn't covered. Um, it has I would make some kind of a pocket here. I think a side pocket right here. This is where the signature would sew in. And then. There's an envelope in here, and this is where I kind of gave up because I messed up. I glued, see the envelope, um, the window? I wanted to be able to see through there and that in the back, but I should have glued it on this. Instead, I glued it on that, so now it's, it's, that's there permanently. So I can still make a pocket there, but it wasn't my intention, and that's when I got frustrated with it and I put it aside, but I think it's very salvageable. And um, from there, I went to this one. So just fooling around with it. And I'm gathering my papers for the signature. And I know I have Braille paper. I just um, got it in. I ordered it through one of the Happy Paper People live sales. And darn if I know where I stored it in my organization for the new year. But that's neither here nor there. I was just giving you a sneak peek of some things I'm working on. So, happy Junk Journal January. I hope you like my day seven and day eight layouts and have a great day, everybody.